if I ran into a little bit of a hitch here and there, you were always there to help uh, help with some advice on how to overcome those obstacles. So yeah, it was a, it was a great part of the process. Hello, my name's Peter Kirst. I'm a project experience manager with RTA Outdoor Living. And we're here with Matt today, and he's gonna share with us how we got to this awesome space and this awesome addition he's had here in his backyard. We're here in my backyard in beautiful Monument, Colorado. I've uh, done several things in the backyard to add to the back patio over the years and had one last thing that I needed to do to tighten it up and that was I needed an addition of some kind of outdoor kitchen or barbecuing space. And so a buddy of mine up in Denver decided that uh, he was gonna use RTA Outdoors for his outdoor kitchen and loved how it turned out. And so went to the website, checked it out, but really top to bottom from the initial process of being able to go to the website and see a 3D rendering, being able to see what I'm getting, just knowing that I can get everything in one place and not have to go down to my local lumber yard or go to my granite supplier, get the granite, go you know to my appliance supplier and get that. Being able to have it all in one place within such a close proximity and price, just having it all done for me with one contact, being able to see everything together, that it's gonna look good. That's, that's really what uh, sold me on RTA and why I would recommend it to really anybody looking to do an outdoor kitchen. Uh, what's one of your favorite parts about this awesome 36 inch grill you got over here? Yeah. S series, by the way. Yeah, yeah. So uh, a couple of things. One is, uh, you know, it's got the briquettes in there, so it keeps the flame down a little bit and holds heat consistently. And just the size of it, I mean, I can get a whole lot of, uh, of meat and veggies on there. With the spice rag being like your favorite appliance yeah. in the kitchen, can you kind of like open it up and kind of yeah, show yeah. us what you got in here? So the spice rack, I have used as much space awesome. as I can. I actually have another drill drawer that's full of spice, two drawers that are mostly full of spices as well. So I love the barbecue, I love the smoke. I do so much out, out here that uh, uh, I had to free up one, or, one of the cabinets in the house yeah. for the wife. And so yeah. the spice rack, brilliant, I love it. Um, it works great. Matt, I remember us talking earlier and what is one thing you love doing out here in your space that really makes your wife happy? <laughs> so I, I, we live in Colorado, I'm an outdoorsman, and so I love to hunt. And so I bring home geese and ducks and pheasant and quail, and my wife hates feathers in the house. And so having this seven foot, uh, seven foot bar, bring it out here, clean it up, and I can hose it off, it's clean. I, I leave all the yuck out uh, outside so that my wife can actually enjoy the meat and not have to deal with the cleaning. Keep it outside. Yep, that's right, that's right. I wanna thank Matt for lending us his time today and giving us a look into his experience using RTA Outdoor Living for his outdoor kitchen project. If you're getting ready to start an outdoor kitchen project, reach out to us at rtaoutdoorliving.com for a kitchen that will last a lifetime and a support experience you can depend on.